everyone Paolo here again so this is a follow-up on some of the PHP how to so we already installed PHP uh, we already have Apache configured uh, we already installed MySQL so this time we're gonna install PHP my admin so go to PHP my admin dot net slash downloads and from there download the latest release uh, you could get all the languages but for me I just downloaded the English version of the zip one so I already have it on my desktop um, so I just extract that and I'm gonna rename this to PHP my admin and I'm gonna open back my terminal I'm gonna open go to the CD sites folder open that and you should get this so just plug in the PHP my admin on that folder uh, it's gonna require some administrator access to move that folder so we'll just plug that in and there you have the folder inside so Go back to your browser and go to localhost and type in tin and put in PHP my admin. You should get something like this. Um, I'm gonna copy this and go to the setup so I could generate a config file. So from there, just type uh, PHP my admin forward slash setup and should bring you to this special wizard so click on new server and server host I'm gonna change this to 127.0.1 and server point I'm gonna leave it as is and server socket I'm gonna put uh, forward slash temp my SQL dot sock there and connection type I'm gonna put socket so that's what you need there. Uh, click on authentication and then um, you could leave authentication type to cookie, uh, the root for the auth and config password for the config auth. So earlier I said one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'm gonna click okay. So this should generate a new file. So I'm gonna click on download here. And should download a file. Gonna open that in the finder and jump into my PHP my admin and directly copy that file over there. And if I move to my PHP my admin and go to root and plug in my password, that should bring me inside PHP my admin and I could create new database, etc. etc. So that's the quick easy way how to set up PHP my admin if you like more videos of some PHP how to's uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel